Welcome back fans, it's Bertie again here with another instalment for you. About to show you what's come through the post this week. I've got a few boxes to run through with you, so let's not delay, let's crack on with it. As normal, get that trusty. So, here we've got, oh, I know it's a single inside of here, and it's got some weird sort of packaging, so let's try and get into here. And we really hope we're not slicing into something we shouldn't do. That was close because it was at this end. Right. Okay, on short cards, we have. Oh, yeah, nice, very nice. Pop, 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 Porsche. 911 GT2. So that is the 996 variant there on a short card really really nice i've picked up um or i say picked up i have got coming quite a few of the 996 gc2 so i've got a few that i've managed to find on ebay this week so there we go that one there gt2 detailing through the back along with that big spoiler light temples quad exhaust detail And as per norm, through the front, beautiful little Porsche crest. And also the glass following through to the lights. So there we go. First one out of the box. Uh, next up, let's do this one here. Oh, let's try and be careful. That's got some addresses on. So we've got some loosey gooseys inside of this one here. And this one I picked up, I can't even remember, because I've had this one since the beginning of last week. So, there we go, get a little browse. Ooh, what's in the bottom there? It's not a Porsche, but, yes, but. So yes, this one here was a nice little bundle that we found on the cheap, I think, from memory. Uh, about six pounds, I think. I'm completely pulling that figure out of the air, actually. Um, but it wasn't a huge amount of money because I think there's only one Porsche inside of here, which is why I justify guessing it. But it has got that lovely Ferrari for those of y'all that have spotted it already. Just need to get into the packaging first without damaging any of the paint on the cars. Let's try and get into that corner. There we go, that's... I'm sorry, people. I'm sorry. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. Okay, there we go. First out of the pack, we have... Is that a Super B? I haven't looked at it. I think it's a Super B with that little thing at the back. It's a Dodge. Dodge Coronet Super B. Yes, Bertie. Yeah, it must be watching far too much American TV. Right, there we go. That one there in white... So it wasn't the reason why I picked up this bundle, but not bad little casting actually. It's cool with that little stripe through the back there. You want to see the top? Actually nice, the way that they've done the uh, chrome detailing for the front, pull through the casting from the bottom, the plastic for the bumpers. Very nice, very nice. First one out of the pack. I can't remember how many were in here. Was it five or six? Okay, so next out, oh, that's a cool little one there. Ford GT40, not Ford GT from 2005, I think it is. Um, that one there is the original, so quite nice. Not golf livery, but it does have um, like a mid blue. Mid blue with sky blue and orange number 40 and orange wheels or orangey goldy wheels can't really call that gold that is more orange but yeah cool little casting there we go back so you've got the again the plastic from the bottom pull through to what would be the exhaust pipes and also the kind of grill um heat release for back of the car which is obviously where the engine is right so second one out Let's go with, I'll tell you what, let's go with that one right there. So 
know that I'm not a huge Lamborghini fan, but that's not to say that I won't appreciate a decent casting when it comes out. I just don't like that Centenario. But this is quite cool. Is that, a, I think, a Revington, Revington Roadster? Yeah, Rivington Rosa in like a flat grey. The silver, silver wheels. Quite cool through the top actually. The detailing for the engine bay and interior as well, if you can make that out. Through the back, again, quite nice. Is that light temples on there? Yes, actually like a silver for the light temples and also the Lamborghini branding. In the middle as well. That's that's quite a cool little casting. It's quite weighty that one as well. Hmm, surprising. Okay, back to the American by the looks of it. Is that American or is this a fantasy? It looks like it might be a fantasy, you know. Rapid transit, yeah, it's a fantasy. I thought it was almost like a Camaro when I first pulled it out, but no, it's not. It's whatever that is. So yeah, I don't think we'll be doing much with that, and that's, but it's, um, actually, inside's not bad. If you can make that. So yeah, lovely. Not exciting. Uh, oh, should we do Porsche Ferrari, Porsche Ferrari, Porsche Ferrari. Let's do the Ferrari, as we are really a Porsche channel, but that is sweet look at that casting for that f12 berlinetta that's lovely in silver these guys sent me out some really nice ones actually these are all pretty pristine to be honest i don't think there's any anything really that worries me about this at all even down to the pininfarina ferrari logo through the front ferrari logo and the temples for the lights across just across the front, not across the back. But that's got quite a nice, quite a nice bottom. Yeah, very nice. There we go. F12 Berlinetta in silver. Very nice. Yeah, cool, 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 cool. Very nice. Again, I've been picking up a couple of bundles actually. I haven't seen any for a little while, so it's quite nice to see some again online. Um, and some do have some Ferrari in, so look forward to that for something a little bit different for you Hot Wheels fans. Right, okay, last out, as I say, we are a Porsche channel, so we have Carrera GT in yellow. Rear light temples, Carrera GT detailing through the back, through the front we have Porsche Crest, and also the light temples for the front. Again, this guy sent me out some nice ones here. There might be a little flag, little paint flag, if you can see, just next to, next to the wheel there. But all in all, not bad at all for a loosey goosey. Quite happy with that little pack. So I'm pretty sure that I paid, I think I paid £6 for the actual cars plus postage, whatever that was. So I think it was definitely under a tenner. Not bad, not bad. Especially for that, that little Ferrari, I like that. Mm. Delving into the dark side, right, okay, let's go with the next box oh now from memory i think i think this contains in here two pieces one of which i will be sharing with you well both i'm going to be sharing with you obviously but one i think i may just have to tease you with and keep keep for a little while and wait for another one to come through this probably makes no bloody sense to you at all, does it? What on earth are you gibbering on about, Bertie? All will become clear. Don't worry. Paper. Paper. Right. Okay, it's going to be my first glimpse. Ooh. Ooh, right, okay. Let's pull out the one that I can show you first of all, and then the other one. I can't show you. I can't show you that. Yeah, I can't do it, no way. So you just have to be patient and hang around. Right, okay, we have on a short card, 911 GT3 RS 997. Yeah. Very nice, very nice indeed. So yeah, in red, little red D sailing around the rims, which is pretty cool little, 
trick to, to pull out on that one there. We've got stripes through the side with the Hot Wheels detail. Hot Wheels? Yeah. Little Hot Wheels detailing running off the stripe. Quite a nice little stripe decal, actually. Uh, even though they try to make it look uh, factory, factory standard. It's even got that little Hot Wheels in there. So, yeah, it kind of works. It's cool. And through the front, stripe through the bonnet. Also, the Porsche crest and your standard light decals across there. So, yeah, this one doesn't have glass into lights. This one has just the temples instead. But again, nice little detailing through the front. They have actually drilled out all of the intakes, which is quite cool. You got that front spitter on there as well. So, through the back, spoiler, dual exhaust, no light temples, but. It's a P -p -p Porsche, we like that. So there we go, that's those, that's those. Oh, and the centre in protector as well. Oh, oh yeah. right. Let me just tease you slightly. Inside of this box here is my most expensive piece so far. It's a main line. So that'll give you a little hint as to what it is. Um, but I'm not saying any more than that. You're just gonna have to wait and see. That's up. <laughs> Off camera, I'm gonna prop a little browser there because it's my first time looking at it. So I'm quite happy with that. Right, last box. And look. Wah, 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 wah. Yes, customs to pay. Unfortunately, this fellow sent it out. Uh, was it from, yeah, it was from the States. It wasn't from Canada. Um, sent this one out from the States and unfortunately on the import documentation, put down the postage and the value. So I actually ended up paying pretty much double for this when I shouldn't have done. Was not happy, sent him quite a abrupt, I will say, message. Um, disclosing my displeasure. But if it wasn't for the facts, that these were such cool castings that are coming out and we're going old school for you people we're going old school for you and i probably would have been really really upset but i said my piece i got it over and done with and yeah i apologize what else can you do what else can you do so inside of here three castings which is quite handy because they'll allow me to have some for customization one for the collection and for the box? Well, no, not really, because they're long cards, so they're not really going to be staying in the box. Woo! -hoo! And also, these are slightly yellowed blisters. But who cares? When you're looking at, ta-da! Porsche 911 Targa. You know how much I love these 1980s, 1970s slash 80s Targas. Love, 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 love. And these are packaged. Packages are quite cool. Apart from the um, apart from the blister being slightly yellowed, they're pretty, pretty decent. There you go. There's the other two. Got it there. So another two targers. So I tell you what. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Silver paint. And we've got door handle trim detail. Nice little touch. Targa bar painted in black. Whale tail, sorry, not whale tail. Uh, spoiler across the rear. I suppose it is whale tail, really. Um, and then, yeah, through there. Shared casting with Corgi, so it's got that AMD 26, is it? Yeah, AMD 26 number plates on the front and the rear. No temples. It's got a little kind of. Um, like etched detail to the lights just so that they kind of pop slightly. It doesn't really come off that well. But yeah, got something special to tell you about these three that have just come in, Hot Wheels fans. This right here is numero 50. Yes, you heard it right, that is number 50. That means I have and in fact, I've got it. I've got it here to hand. I've got it here to hand. This box, this box right here. Hear it, people? I'm gonna put number 50 inside of the box. Keep your eyes peeled. That video is coming really soon. See you in the next one.